Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So we got Doran out here today. Yeah, again. Again. Yesterday we tried it. We caught one nice size one, but we at the dam at Water Reed trying to get on these cats. I'm gonna show y'all what we using for bait. We just got some small brim. Got some small brim. We gonna cut up and uh, throw on these lines. I'm, I'm gonna show y'all the rig I'm using today. This is the Santee rig. Just a weight. There you go. It's just a weight right here. That's a two ounce weight with a barrel swivel, a bobber, and the hook. This keeps the the bobber keeps the bait off of, off of the bottom. So it's suspended. The suspended catfish. But we gonna cut these fish up, throw them out there, and I'm gonna turn on the GoPro and show y'all how the how we how we do it down here. <laughs> He got it, he got it. Yes, sir. First catch. Not too long. It ain't took too long. First fish with this bait caster. Mm, open your mouth, boy. Let's get it. Let's get it, boy. Yes, sir. What do you say? We already on it. You already know it. This is what we do. Talk your stuff, boy. You swallow? Yeah, he didn't swallow it too bad, though. On the pitching? Number one. So now you gotta fix that back up. Oh no. Oh dang. Oh yeah. I do. I gotta put another. Put another one on. You might want to get your knife. Nah, it don't matter. Well, that had to get away from us. <laughs> <laughs> I was sitting just not like the fuss at me. You ain't with that. You been good with that net just now. I see that. I see that thing start bending. I said, oh, it get real now. <laughs> I said, it get real, real quick. I ain't lying. Them hold them like sharks, low key, from far away. Talking about them on um, catfish? Yeah, they like shark from far away. I said, we got caught a shark. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I said they say no mega mouth for gonna be it. We don't want these lines there. Mega what? Mega mouth. Talking about megalodon? Yeah, but I said mega mouth because I don't, I don't like messed up the word. <laughs>
Hey, we always hit in that spot first, though. We hit in that same spot yesterday. Yeah. You still got your other rod out? Why you ain't fishing with that one? We might we might need some more bait, boo. Get in there, get in there. When you put it, when you put it, bro. Where that? What is that? A catfish. Get put him in. Oh, let go. <laughs> ah! That thing, that thing bite a worm. A worm? A worm, bro. Hey. Another one. Nah, it ain't. Look at that slime, cuz. What do you need? Them pliers. I think I had put them in my. Oh, I got them. I got them. Huh? You see it right there? Yeah, I got him. Oh, that's a big one. That's a nice one here. Oh, he about the same size. Doing the job today, what? Oh yeah, we working today. Uh -huh. What's up? Oh yeah. Shh. See if anyone can hear that. Open up that cooler. Yeah. I was just trying to let the other fall. I'm telling you, bro, that one the hot spot, bro. Wherever you throwing that over there, that must be where they be sleeping at, boy. They wake up hungry. Nah, but this, the first fish came off of over here. No, but I guess yeah. it just in this general area right here, that's probably where the deepest hole is at.
I'm gonna cut, I'm gonna cut this tail part off YouTube so it won't be hard for them to swallow it. I always throw the tail part around one of my rods for chum, like chumming. Hold on, wait, okay. wait. I'm about to grab it. Watch out, though. slow down we might have to relocate how many more brim we got in there like four and then mm -hmm. I do say we reload we go somewhere else though that's what I do say I feel like but if we if we relocate we need to um probably go in that corner right there and try to catch some more brown first All right, guys, so we out here at um, Hobby Island, and we threw our lines out. Got some more cut brim, and uh, trying to get on some more cats. Trying to get a big one. I actually parked the boat over there. We're doing that. I got two lines in the rod holder. Right there, I don't know if y'all can see them, but two lines over there. And then I got one line out right here. And the other line out right here. So I'm gonna turn on the GoPro. And we're gonna see what we can do. But man, we chilling. We are chilling. 7-Eleven. It's 7-Eleven and we don't got our bike yet. But it's gonna happen very soon. Very, 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 very soon. 7 Eleven. And nothing has happened yet. Hey, Dawn. Hand, hand me them worms and them, and them fishing rods. I'm about to throw some bobbles over here. Oh, snap. I got one. I know y'all seen that. Ah, oh, 
Ah, he broke the hook off. Clean off. <sighs> wow. That's 40 pound braid, so I don't understand how that happened, but it happened. Y'all seen that fish jump just now? Yeah, that done in right there. You think so? Yeah, that done there. You think so? Oh, oh I got him. I got him. Let's go. We still out here getting them things. Still out here getting them things. Look, with a with a with a malfunction. With a malfunction. Hey, hey, you can't tell me I wasn't smart now. I hold that pole up so high in the air. Man, God. Oh. No, that just the tip of it. Got another nice one. I'm about to throw them in the cooler. We about to get ready to go. It's getting late. One before sunset. Huh? Yeah. Well guys, it's getting darker. It's getting dark. 
So we about to go. We had a good time. Dorian was playing around and end up um, doing something with my boat. <laughs> y'all seen? Um, y'all seen? I had a nice cat on and it ended up popping off. But I was eating myself. We got a uh, four. I'm gonna show y'all when I get to the house what we ended up with. But we got four. We gonna head to the house and uh, yeah. All right. We ended up with those four. Those the four that we was talking about. Not too bad. They're not the biggest catfish, but they're good eating size. So, got some dinner. I appreciate you guys for tuning in to J Cameron Outdoors. Until next time, peace out.